everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys my Squishmallow collection. Now, I just did a Squishmallow video. I went Squishmallow hunting. Didn't really find anything. If you wanna go see that, go check it out. But I thought I would show you guys my Squishmallow collection today because I have built quite the collection. Not as many as a lot of people have. I feel like people that do Squishmallow videos have way more than I do, but I'm just starting my collection not too long ago and I really like my collection, so I thought I'd show you guys what I have. I'm just gonna go ahead and get into these because I. I have quite a bit and I'm just gonna run through them show you which ones I have what size they are and then I'll tell you their names so let's just go ahead and start off with the biggest squishmallows that I own so I'm gonna start off with the one that you guys have already seen because I just held it up like two seconds ago but this is my first big one that I got both of my big ones are 16 inches so this is the first one I have which is the strawberry and she's 16 inches and her name is Scarlet I really like this one. I actually use this as my pillow to sleep with at night. Like, instead of a regular pillow, I put this under my head. Um, it's super comfortable. I absolutely love it. So yeah, she's so cute. She's getting a little bit lumpy on the side because this is where I usually lay my head. <laughs> so that kind of stinks, but I love this one. This is Scarlet the Strawberry. And my next big one, which is a 16 inch, is this one. It is a snail. She's so cute, she's like pink, and then her shell has like tie-dye colors on it. And her name is Selvina, Selvina? I think that's how you say it, Selvina. She is so cute, she's also very squishy. And I don't normally use this one as a pillow just cause she's a little bit like plumper than Scarlet, I guess. But yeah, it is really nice to use as a pillow if you would like. I feel like a little kid doing this, but it's fine. Now I'm gonna move on to my 12 inch ones. Um, I think some are 10 inch and some are 12, so if I can remember, I'm going to do the 12 inch ones first and then I'll do the 10 inch, but it's kind of hard to remember which ones are which, so let's go to the 12 inch first. So starting off with my 12 inch, I have this little dinosaur, he's so cute, he is green tie dye, and I'm pretty sure his name is Rosia. I have the tag still, I keep them in a little container. So let me grab their tags just to make sure I know the names. Okay, so yes, I was right. His name is Rocio. Super cute, so fluffy, and he has a little tail. But he, I really like this one. I think it's really cute. And I really like the dinosaur ones. I think they're adorable for some reason. And um, but yeah, so this is Rocio. Next one I have is another one of my favorites. I feel like they're all my favorites. I feel like I'm gonna be saying that like the whole time. <laughs> but this one is a dragon. Sorry if they're a little bit deformed. It just kind of happens sometimes. Um, but this is the cutest little dragon ever. He's like a light green. I don't even know what color you call this, but it's so cute. And this one's name is Drew. This one is adorable and I love this one. <laughs> I think this is like top favorite ones that I have. I don't know, I keep saying that, but this is probably one of my faves. Anyways, he's so cute, love his little wings, and this one's name is Drew. Moving on to another 12 inch, I have my little lobster, he's so cute. I normally don't like red, but I think he's just so adorable, and this color red is really pretty. Um, but yeah, he's just a little lobster. I love it. It reminds me of Friends, so that's why I like it too. Nothing crazy about him, he just has this cute little tail, and he's got his claws, and he's so soft, and his name is Louie. Louis the Lobster. They should have done Larry the Lobster, that would have been awesome, but Louis's cute too. <laughs> so this is Louis. And I have two more 12 inches left. So this one is also so adorable. Um, I mean, they're all adorable unless they're the really ugly ones, and you probably know which ones I'm talking about. Um, but this one is Bruce, and he is a walrus. Look how cute he is with his little arms and then his little feet back here. <laughs> He's so cute. I love that he has his eyes closed too. I think that's adorable. And he's super squishy and he's so cute. So yeah, this is Bruce in a 12 inch. One more 12 inch left. And this is another one of my favorites because I just got it recently. So I'm still like in love with it at the moment. And I have never seen this one before, like on TikTok or in YouTube videos. And I found it at Cracker Barrel and I was so happy I found it. But this one is a little penguin. Her name is Luna 
and they do have normal Luna the penguins, you know, without the earmuffs and the scarf. But I saw this one and I thought it was so cool that she had earmuffs and a scarf. I have seen the normal penguin before, but I've never seen it with like the little the little things. So I thought that was so cool. And the little scarf has snowflakes on it and I, she's just so cute. I can't. She's so cute. So this is Luna. Now I'm gonna move on to my 10 inch ones. I'm pretty sure these are 10 inch. It's hard to remember because I know they have 10, 11, and 12 sometimes, but I think these are 10 inch ones. The first 10 inch one I have is one that's pretty famous, I feel like, and it's just Baby Yoda. Super cute. He has these really big ears that are super floppy, and yeah, he's really cute. I like the 10 inch sizes because they're like big enough to like, I don't know but they're not super big. I, I just like the size. I like this for the 12 inch is probably my favorite, but he's so cute. We have a little baby Yoda. And then the one that's my favorite right now out of my 10 inches because I just got it is my little bearded dragon and his name is Abe. He's a little bit deformed because I sleep with him at night <laughs> right now. So I kind of smush him, but yeah, he's adorable. He's like this mint green color bearded dragon with a really fuzzy belly. And then he has a little tail and he has these little stripes on him. So cute. I like the bearded dragon ones. I kind of want the orange one because they're just so cute. He's also like really like, I don't know. What do you call that? Like really stuffed. I don't know. He's kind of a chunky boy, but this is Abe the bearded dragon. Now I just have my eight inches and then I do have two clips that I'm going to show you. I did four, I mean two. <laughs> so let's we'll start with the eight inches first. So this is one of the first Squishmallows I ever got. I actually did get two at the same time. The first time I ever went Squishmallow hunting because like I was obsessed and I wanted everything I could find. So this is the first one. And this is the little guava. I can't remember her name. Let me see if I can find it. Oh, Lena. It's either Lena or Lena. I feel like it might be Lena. So I'm gonna call her Lena. So this is Lena the guava, super cute. A lot of people get confused and think she's a watermelon, but the watermelon does look a little different. I will show you side by side in a minute, but she's so cute because she's a little flower. And because I got her at Cracker Barrel, I'm pretty sure it's only for Cracker Barrel. I'm not sure though. I just said I'm pretty sure and then I said not sure. I'm not sure. I think it's only a Cracker Barrel, but she is scented. I don't know what kind of scent she has. Like it doesn't really smell like a fruit, but it just smells super sweet and it's, it's adorable. So this was one of the ones I wanted the most in the beginning, like when I was looking online and I found her as my first one. So I thought that was super cool. So this is Lena the Guava. Okay, now I have the watermelon. So this is Wanda the watermelon, super cute. Also a little deformed. I'm trying to like make them look nice, but sometimes it just happens. <laughs> um, super, super cute. I love her. My mom actually has a 16 inch of her because she's just that cute. <laughs> so I will show you side by side the guava and the watermelon. They're similar, but they are different. She has the black seeds and the guava has like the pink patches there. Also, the outside is different. So she looks like an actual watermelon and this just has like some sort of tie-dye green print on it. And she's winking with a flower on her head and this one's just plain. But that's the difference between the watermelon and the guava. But this is Wanda and she's so cute and I love her. So this is Wanda the watermelon. I'm just grabbing random ones now. So this next one is also really cute. I'm gonna keep saying that. I just don't know how to introduce them because they're all so cute. I just feel like I have to keep saying it. Anyways, this is Heather and she is a dragonfly super adorable and i love how her wings are like different colors and yeah it's just super cool and she has these little antenna i love the colors together the purple and blue i think it's really cute so this is heather the dragonfly i have so many i have a pile over here of just squishmallows it's crazy um okay so my next one is henry the turtle from the front you don't really look like a turtle and then you turn him around and he has this shell. Um, so cute. He's like the perfect roundness. I don't know, I really like him. Um, I do want the other turtle, um, Antonio or something like that. I feel like that's not right. Anthony, Anthony, Anthony. I want him, he's cute. But I got Henry for now and he, yeah, he's super soft and super cute. So we have Henry the turtle. So my next one is Dustin the Dalmatian. He is so cute and he has little red glasses. I've seen him without glasses before, but I found the one that has glasses, so I think he's super cute with the glasses. 
and it reminds me of like Cruella de Vil or something. I don't know. <laughs> Because the red and the Dalmatian, I guess. But he is so adorable. I normally don't like the dog ones that much, even though I love dogs. But yeah, I don't know. Something about him, like the spots, I guess. I just thought it was super cute. So this is Dustin the Dalmatian. Okay, moving on to the last two 8 inch I have left. This was the other one that I got um, first. And so that is judy the tangerine she is so cute and this one does not have the glasses which i'm kind of happy about because i did not like the glasses on judy um personally so yeah i was happy she didn't have glasses but she is just a little tangerine i love her stems up here they're so soft and she is tie-dye the tie-dye ones do tend to be less soft but they're still really nice so this is Judy the Tangerine. And I saved the best 8 inch for last. This is definitely my favorite and I want more of her in different sizes. So this is Celia the Orange. I am in love with Celia the Orange. Now there is another orange which is the guy and his name is Orin. But I really like Celia, Celia because I like her little eyelashes. But this is like my favorite one for sure. But all I could find in her was the 8 inch which I'm kind of bummed. But hopefully I can find a bigger size of her because she's just the cutest thing ever. I love her. Her color is so pretty and her little eyelashes and her stem and her leaf. I just she's so cute so this is celia the orange and that is it for my 8 inch 12 inch 10 inch and 16 inch now i'm gonna move on to the clips that i have so i have them on my keys actually i'm just gonna show you them on my keys so the first one that i got was the b her little antenna is always messed up but this is the b and her name is sunny super cute i love her this is the first clip i found and i just thought she was really cute also um i am terrified of bees it's just like a big fear i have but my nickname is izzy b so kind of ironic but yeah so i always get stuff with bees on it usually i just think it's cute because it's my nickname so yeah that's why i got sunny so this is sunny the clip and the next clip i have ugh, i wanted him in a bigger one but i decided on something else instead of him so i got him in the clip but this is gordon in a clip he's so cute and he has the little black fins um normally i don't think he has the black fins some are different than the others i'm not sure but he's so cute he's a little shark this little tail oh my goodness so i have gordon the clip and sadly that is all of the ones i have i'm just kidding it's not that sad because i do have a lot and i'm trying to kind of like chill out for a while but um unless i see one that i really want then i'm gonna get it that is my squishmallow collection um i did just want to say i know i have a lot and it's kind of weird being 20 years old with stuffed animals but to me i love it so i don't really care but I just wanted to say also that for me personally, I have anxiety and the squishmallows tend to help a lot with anxiety. For me, like I said, I don't know about for everyone, but I think just like being able to hold it because it's soft and sometimes I just like pet it. <laughs> but because they are so soft in the material, it just kind of calms me down. So that is another big reason why I really do love them. And they're super cute. I mean, come on, really? They're so adorable. So anyways, I just wanted to say that that's one of the big reasons why I have so many and why I love them. So I hope you guys liked my collection. It's not too many, but it's still a lot. And um, if I buy any more, I will show you guys if you would like that, if you guys like these types of videos. I also do go squishmallow hunting quite a bit. So if you want to see more, just let me know in the comments below. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to give a big thumbs up if you liked it. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. And that's pretty much it. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.